One and two, Dream Team, it's your boy d Mew back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with 15 things you didn't know about India. Before we dive in, make sure you subscribe, ring notification bell, give the video a thumbs up so it gets suggested. Talk to me. 15 things you didn't know about India. Welcome to Alux.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. Hey, I'd love to be one of those. Hello, Aluxers, and welcome back to another fascinating video. Today, we're looking at an incredible facts you didn't know about the seventh largest country in the world, India. Talk With a population me. of over a billion people, India is one of Gosh. the most influential and powerful countries in the world. Its cultural history is particularly complex and detailed, spanning 4,500 years of predominantly Hindu philosophy and theology. Thousands of years later, modern India is profoundly different with its own colossal film industry, a diverse population, and an astonishingly big workforce. Because Alux.com is dedicated to becoming the world's best resource on the most interesting countries and destinations, we couldn't wait to bring you 15 things you didn't know about India. Number 1. Bollywood's highest grossing film made 27 times more than Hollywood's highest grossing film. For every 600 films Hollywood produces, Bollywood will make 1,000. They're the most profitable films too when you compare the numbers. Hollywood's highest grossing film was 2009's Avatar, which made $2.8 billion at the box office. In stark uh -huh. contrast, the Bollywood film Three Idiots brought in $76.81 billion. Now that's a profit. I saw a comment that was telling me Bollywood was like way bigger than Hollywood. Uh, I truly did not know that. Like, grossing wise, I truly did not know. They said Hollywood's biggest grossing was Avatar. Like $2.9 billion. And India's Three Idiots grossed 70 Six billion. Oh yeah, they put uh, they put Hollywood to shame. My heaven, that's insane. They also make one thousand movies compared to every six hundred movies Hollywood. Yeah, okay, Bollywood. Okay, I'm sorry, I didn't know. I thought Hollywood was the biggest in the world, but Bollywood is much big, much much bigger. Sheesh. Number 2. Shampoo was invented in the 16th century, India. Derived from the Sanskrit champu, which means massage, the concept of shampooing was invented in India in the 16th century. Herbs and natural ingredients were used then rather than today's combination of modern chemicals and fragrances, in particular gooseberry, sapindus, oh, wow. and fruit pulp. When colonial visitors came to India, they brought the practice of shampooing and hair washing back with them to Europe. Ah, I shout out to India for giving us shampooing, dog. Shout, that that was a big thing the entire world needed. Number three, diamonds were first mined in India, and it was the world's greatest producer. Really, India was the most productive diamond mining country in the world until diamonds were found in Brazil in the 18th century. There are now three active diamond mines in India, and the famous Kohinoor diamond was found in the 13th century. The 793 carat stone oh went from person to person and was eventually acquired by Queen Victoria during the British Raj in India. Huh. Number four. That's crazy. Diamonds were first mined in. Hold up. India then gave a lot to the world, dog. India doing a thing out there. Elephants in Kerala can treat themselves to a spa day. What? Pune Thor Kata Elephant Yard Rejuvenation Center provides elephants with baths, massages, and soothing pamper sessions. The spa what? caters to 59 clients and is a way of giving back to the sacred animal. Elephants play an important role in Kerala's temple processions and are a significant feature of the region, so they deserve a massage every now and then. That's crazy. That's amazing! The largest religious gathering in India can be seen from space. Are you serious? Kumbha Mela is a Hindu pilgrimage which takes people to the banks of the Ganges every 12 years. The major event involves ritualistic bathing, devotional singing, religious discussion, and feeding the poor. 
The attendance figures had to be capped at 75 million, making it the largest oh, wow. pilgrimage on Earth. 75 Number million six. can be seen from space? Has anyone ever seen it from space? I didn't even know you could see people from space. Are you sure? Can you even see people from space? I don't know. I don't know. Ancient Indian civilization is the oldest in the world. We often look to ancient Greece and ancient Egypt, but Indian civilization dates back to 2400 BC, when it was split into 16 monarchies known as the Mahajanapadas. There are even authenticated human remains that date back to 30,000 years in South Asia. The oldest Hindu texts were written between 2000 and 500 BC, as well as the first texts on science, medicine, and astronomy. We actually owe the number zero to Indian mathematics, who created the concept. Huh. Number seven. India is home to every major world religion and doesn't have a national language. Hinduism, every? Christianity, Buddhism, Islam, and Sikhism all have a place in Indian society, with the most dominant being mm. Hinduism and Islam, covering 80% and 14% of the population, respectively. Judaism has existed in India for the last 2,215 years, and some of these smaller religions also featured, including Jain, Zoroastrian, and Baha'i. India also Zoro has a single national language because 1,652 dialects are spoken across yeah. the different regions. 1,652 different dialects is crazy. But I mean, in a country that has over 1 billion people, that's not surprising, but that's so much. Number eight. A polling station is set up for just one voter in Gear Forest at Are every election. Are you serious? Every election, Marant Barandas de Shandas gets his local polling station entirely to himself because he's the only resident of Gear Forest. What? He's been voting in Indian elections since 2004 and never misses one now that he has his own personal polling station. Mahant is the caretaker for the one temple in the forest in Gujarat, a home he shares with the rare Asiatic Ooh, lion. Ooh, hold on. Number nine, the Indian government has used scaffolding to hide the Taj Mahal when airstrikes are predicted. During the Second huh. World War and the Indian-Pakistan Wars, scaffolding was put up around the distinctive domes of the Taj Mahal to make it less obvious from above. They feared strikes by the Japanese Air Force during World War II, so hid their most famous landmark. Huh. More recent threats to the Taj Mahal include the rising levels of the Yamuna River, which has cracked the tomb underneath the structure. There have oh, been predictions wow. that the tombs could collapse at any time. Check out our oh, video, dang. 15 Most Expensive Man-Made Attractions in the World, to find out what ranks along the stunning Taj Mahal. That was smart to hide it, dog, with scaffolding. I said, y'all ain't, ain't taking out the Taj Mahal, dog. Y'all gonna think y'all took it out, but it would have been something else. Number 10. Indians invented navigation, yoga, really? the world's cheapest car, and thorium-based nuclear power. They invented navigation? Indian society can take credit for some of the most important inventions in the world. They were the first to create the concept of navigation, over 6,000 hmm. years ago, using rivers and seas. Yoga was created 5,000 years ago, and that one doesn't surprise Hinduism, me. Buddhism and Jainism. The world's cheapest car, the Tata Nano, which costs around 100,000 rupees, the equivalent of $1,400. Oh, yeah, India, I'm going to need me one of those. <laughs> I'm going to need me one of those, dog, right now. It's the home of the first next-generation thorium reactor. The country is aiming to produce 30% of its electrical power with thorium by 2050. Number 11. You can stay at the former Indian royal residence for $88,000 a God night. God dang. If you want to stay at the lap of luxury, forget Paris and forget Dubai. India is the home of the most stunning palaces in the world. Once the home of the Maharajas, there are opulent palaces throughout the country with some dating back hundreds of years. The Kumarakam Lake Resort hosted Prince Charles's 65th birthday, and the 450-year-old Samod Palace in Jaipur has hosted famous faces from all over the world. Dang. Number 12. That's kind of lit, though, dog. You can stay there for 88 I mean, of course, I could probably never stay there. Uh, 
but it's lit that you can like if you rich like you multi millionaire billionaire to stay in that palace would be absolute legit but i guess if you that rich you don't probably built your own palace i don't know King Jai Singh of Alwar snubbed Rolls-Royce in the best possible way. India has a long and colorful history of quirky monarchies and extravagant kings and queens. The King of Alwar in northeast India was insulted by a Rolls-Royce salesman when he visited a showroom in London. A very proud man, he ordered a whole fleet of Rolls-Royce cars and gave them to the city's waste department so they could use them to transport rubbish throughout the city. Oh my god! Number That's 13. crazy. One million Indians are millionaires. India has one of the most dramatic wealth gaps in the world, with 35% of the country living below the poverty line. Those who live Dang. way above it live a very different kind of life. The richest Indian 35? in the world is Mukesh Ambani, who has a net worth of $53 billion. The 59-year-old <laughs> made his money in the oil and gas industry, and his billion-dollar home recently made headlines because he chose to build a 27-story skyscraper instead of a sprawling mansion. This man built himself a skyscraper, dog. <laughs> a skyscraper. $56 billion. You couldn't... I, I guess you got to build a skyscraper because, like... You can't really spend that money if you want to. <laughs> Number 14. The first account of plastic surgery was found in an ancient Sanskrit text. Are you serious? One of the first medical texts was the Sushruta Samhita, which can be dated back to the 6th century CE. It's one of the very first examples of a medical text and discusses surgery, incisions, skin grafts, and nose reconstruction. Britain's Ooh. first nose job wouldn't be performed until 1814, a worrying 80 years before the Sushruta Samhita would be translated. Hmm. Number 15. One of India's most extravagant weddings caused controversy because it was too extravagant. Huh. Lasting five days and costing $74 oh, wow. million, dollars, the wedding of the daughter of a prominent businessman made headlines in 2016 for all the wrong reasons. The $2.5 million wedding sari, Bollywood royalty in attendance, and gold Bangalore palace setting was denounced as an obscene display of wealth. Millions of Indians live in poverty, so the wedding was criticized for being in mm. poor taste. I can understand why people would be mad, there are many but many stereotypical yeah. images of India, but there's so much more to this incredible country than many of us know. The center of many industries and the world's biggest democracy, India has influenced art, literature, science, and medicine potentially more than any other nation. If you could take a trip to this beautiful, fascinating country, where would you find yourself? In a gorgeous Maharaja's palace, surrounded by palm trees and rural countryside? Or a modern apartment in the thick of busy Mumbai? Probably an apartment, dog. Uh, that that's it. I was still a minute left. Bro, has that the richest wedding ever performed? Seventy-four million dollars. Oh, you're still here. Here's another bizarre and oh, okay. incredible fact oh. about India. Okay, about go. Forty percent of the Indian population is vegetarian, making yes, it the largest I've seen veggie that. population in the world. Many choose to not eat meat for spiritual and religious reasons, with beef and pork products often ruled out of their diet. Vegetarianism is so influential that KFC, McDonald's, and Pizza Hut had to introduce vegetarian menus for their Indian franchises to cater Aww. to the population. The country with the fewest vegetarians is Portugal, where just 1.8% of the population have cut meat from their diet. Really? Thank you for spending some time with us, Aluxer. Make sure to subscribe so you never miss That one. was, that was, bro, India done did so many amazing things in this world it's insane i still can't get a 74 million dollar wedding dog like god 35 percent of people living under the poverty line is crazy and to have one million millionaires that's all we got y'all 
Make sure y'all subscribe, ring notification bell, get a video, a thumbs up. It's your buddy Neil. Out.